Hey people, welcome to This Too Is. And on today's episode, it's going to be a little bit different. Um, I got a few messages asking if I could put together a little list of things for um, the beginner uh, woodworker and what they might like on a for a gift or a stocking stuffer and things like that. So I went ahead and compiled a little list in no particular order that I'm going to go ahead and share with you guys. And um, before I go on any further, I just want to remind everybody that my channel is mostly for, you know, like a DIYer, somebody who's just starting off with their tool set, you know, trying to put together some tools and um, stuff like that. You know, I'm, I'm not a pro. I never claim to be a pro at any tools. So please keep that in mind. And also that the information that I share is mostly just to, um, to share with everybody what I know. And um, that's why I always ask you guys if you have anything to add or any information that could help um, the rest of our tool family to please put it down on the comments because the more that we know about it, any one particular tool will benefit us all. You know, so maybe I'll say something that most of you guys already know, especially if you guys are professionals at what you do. But um, there's also some people who are hearing this for their first time, you know, maybe they are buying their first tools ever. Or like I said, you know, just putting their tool set together. So with that said, um, I'm going to go on and uh, start with my list. And like I said, in no particular order. And we're going to start off with this. Um, it's called the glue bot. And it's just a dispenser. It's just a glue dispenser that comes with a couple of different tips. And um, you can just, you know, change out the tips. And it also has this other little, um, this other um, tip that you, that you can, um, you can put on there. And what it does is. It, it can write, it writes the, when you have it on the, on your bottle, it, it writes the board where you're putting the glue that way it can stay on, on the, the glue can stay on the, on the intended um, target and not drip all over the place. So, you know, it just comes with a different, uh, a couple of different um, tips. It comes with this um, wide tip, and then it comes with this little thinner tip right here. I don't know if you guys can see it, but yeah. So that's, and then here, this one is another um, dispenser, and this one is like a roller. So what you do with this one is pretty much the same thing. You fill it up with glue, of course. And um, let me open this up. And once you have your glue in there, you can, you know, use it as a roller. The, you squeeze the glue out, and as the glue is coming out, it's squeezing out to, your, to the wood, and you can just roll it like that. So again, it's, you know, to not make a big old mess and get the glue where it's intended to be at. And since we're in the glue um, area, we're going to go ahead and show this one as well. This is... Uh, easy cleaning silicone tool, it, which is a just a, a silicone uh, brush. So you once you put the glue, you can brush it on and um, get the glue across whatever you ever you need it. And then it also has a a little um, sharp part right here where you can uh, also use that for uh, you know whatever you need you know to. Uh, do the edges or whatever, like that. Okay. Another thing that's very important in the woodworker is measurements. So right here we have this Irwin. This is a tri and miter square. And what I like about this one is that it actually comes with the, the little um, bubble right here where it shows you that you know you have it straight 
So not only do you have the measurements over here, but you also could uh, make sure that it's balanced and centered correctly with that. And most of these tools that I'm showing you are um, things that you could find at your local big box stores or, or on Amazon, you know. And uh, most of them are inexpensive and, you know, $20 or less. So that's why they're good on um, stacking stuffers. But everybody needs one of these because, you know, you could, um, these, these are good to set up your uh, blade, especially on, uh, on your um, table saw and stuff like that. This one right here is a, it's a gauge, depth gauge setter for your router. And I'll show you how this one, you can use this one. And there it is, depth gauge. Easy and accurate depth adjustments in addition to perfect settings in precise 116 increments. So it goes in 116 increments from a one eighth all the way to one inch. And the way you use this is um, you measure the depth like this. So this one right here, I'm pretty sure is set at 9 16 which is this side. And there it is. I mean, you can't really see it because, uh, but that's how you measure it. You know, depending on the height right here, that's how you measure the depthness. And like I said, you know, you can measure everything from one eighth all the way to one inch. So that's that's a lot of, um, it covers a, a large area. So this is a good um, measurement um, um, gauge to have. And of course the um, the square, the tri-square right here. Um, these ones um, are on the gift center at Home Depot right now and they, they're coming to set with a uh, with a small one and a bigger one right here so um these are also um good to uh, you know to measure um let me see and then and then this little lip helps you helps you um slide it across so you get you could get the reading that you need very easy as long as you keep it straight you know you could get your lines drawn and and everything exactly the way you need it and you get two different ones. This come in a, in a pack together. Also, you could buy them single, um, you know, separate. But right now they they have a deal where you get them both for like, I think it's fourteen ninety five or nineteen ninety five. But you know, if you get them both together, you'll get a better deal right now. And of course, everybody needs a pencil. And this is uh, a carpenter pencil which um, helps you reach um, hard to reach places with the, with the thin needle nose type of, um, of um, tip right here. And it comes with six leads. This one, uh, you can find it at Amazon. Well, actually, it's, yeah, it comes with six plus the lead that's inside. So it's a total of seven. And um, it comes with a sharpener and you know, you just click it. The sharpener is actually screwed onto the top right here. Right here, right under there is the sharpener. And um, like I said, you know, you can uh, use this area right here to reach um, harder reach places. Let me see if I can open it. Since you guys, since I'm cutting this with these, uh, these are them uh, vampire uh, shears that are made by vamp, you know, the ones that make the vampires. These things do not, are not worth what I paid for them. I paid like 30 something dollars and some regular scissors, some cheap scissors are way better than this. Look, you could barely cut this, man. So I would not recommend those to anybody. You know, they're definitely not worth $30, I'll tell you that. So yeah, that's, you know, that kind of information is what I, I want all you guys to share. You know, if you come across products that don't work to your expectations or to what they said they would do, please put it down in the comments so that the rest of us can be aware of it. 
and won't go out and buy things that don't work. So like I said, here's the leads and they come in a regular lead and a yellow color lead so you can write on other surfaces and see it. Uh, with this one, you can use it on, um, on pretty much any surface from, um, let me see, where did that thing go? Yeah, you can use it on, the lead is, the lead works on, no, it doesn't say here, but it works pretty much on any surface. And um, so if you got if you got a square and you can you know reach into hard to reach places, or if, if it's um if it's somewhere on the wall where you have to go in between um something that's deeper, you know that that um thin head of the pencil right there will help you reach it without um, any problems. So that's why I like this um, style of pencil. Also, these um, this countersink set right here. You know, you need these so uh, when you're making a when you're building whatever you're building with it, with your wood project, you can countersink your screws. That way, you can't feel them when you're when you're putting it together. And um, this is a little pack that comes with the number six, the number eight, and the number ten, which is nine sixty fourths, eleven sixty fourths, and a three six. So you get three um, three different sizes with the little L wrench right here to tighten it up on the side as you want, uh, right here as as you need it. You you uh, move this up and down depending on the depth that you need. It's a tapered drill bit countersink, um, a quarter quarter hex shank. So you can use these on your um, impact driver or your drill, either one, it'll, it'll work on either one. This one here is another um, good idea, or you know, a good invention or whatever you wanna call it. It's a flexible shaft bit extension with a magnetic tip. So whatever um, bit you put on there is it, gonna be held down magnetically. It's great for harder reach places the shaft flexes up to 90 degrees it will not rotate during use so um you know on them hard to reach places these are um the this that's where these are going to come in handy because um you don't have to worry about getting your whole drill in there as long as you could get this piece in there like as far like this picture here as long as you could get that piece in there you'll be able to screw and unscrew whatever you need to do I know that the wall has one that, you know, it, it's a lot better than this one, but that one is like five times the, the price is this one. This one actually is on sale right now at Home Depot. So, um, you know, for this Black Friday 2021 at Home Depot, this one is on sale right here for like 10 bucks. So that's a good deal on this one. And this one is a sanding block. And what I like about this one is um, you can use this uh, you know them hard to reach places because most you know most of you're gonna sand with your um um cordless sander or your um corded sander whatever you know electric sander that you might have but there's a, always going to be some corners that you can uh, reach with that so that's when this is going to come in handy and this is a nice size black right here that you can grab really nice and get into those areas and crevices where uh, the other um sander might not allow you to so this is a a, a real nice uh, sanding black so i think that pretty much covered up the 10 um the 10 uh, gift ideas that i had for you guys but i'm gonna go ahead and uh, throw in a few extras real quick and that's the digit like this is digital gauge angle gauge right here it's a must have for anybody that wants to set any kind of um, saw, the blade. All you do, it has a magnetic base. So what you do, you stick it straight onto the um, to the blade. And as you're rotating, it is gonna be changing the, as you're rotating it, stick it onto the um, blade. And as you're rotating it or moving it, it's gonna be dialing in that number. So this is a, a must have right here for anybody who's um, beginning with the woodworking. Another um, digital 
uh, measuring devices this um uh, T bevel right here this one is by husky and um, this one is also um digital so pretty much the same thing as you move it you're gonna see the numbers move as you move the uh the bevel so whenever you set it to where you want it like say if you want it then you don't want it to move you just push this button and it'll hold your um, number so there it is that's your angle that you have there and also you know it moves either this way that way you know a t bevel so you could uh, pretty much measure in any direction get those weird angles and lock them in so this is another one that comes in handy when nothing else will do the job and of course you know as far as safety you always got to make sure that you have some uh, safety glasses and what i like about these ones right here is that they have the bifocal area right here i don't know you the camera's picking it up but um you know, for us older guys that whose eyes are going bad, it'll um, help you help you be able to um, to to read whatever it is because it has the the bifocal um, part right here to enlarge the magnify whatever it is you're trying to uh, read, and it also protects your eyes at the same time. Now the next two are a little bit more expensive than everything I've showed so far. These right here are uh, the step drill bits by Milwaukee. And um, pretty much you can um, drill a hole from this one right here. The small one goes up to a, a half inch. Yeah, it goes up to a half inch. And it starts at one it starts at 164 it starts at 164 and it goes all the way to a half inch right here and on this one it starts at um well this one doesn't say where it starts at but it goes all the way to one inch and an eighth one and one eighth inch so this one doesn't say exactly where it starts but it goes up to one and one eighth inch so pretty much got everything covered with these two right here like i said these are a little bit more expensive i'm sorry that this video is dragging on i'm trying to go fast but this one also is a uh, very important because if you're beginning with woodworking you need to know that you've got to cover and protect your lungs so what better thing than this uh filtration mask right here which is uh filters up to 99.9 .9 of all dust and particles from the air and this one it's uh it comes in this little bag right here where you could store it and what i like about it is that it's um it's soft you know so when you put it on it has the uh the breathing um things right here and it also just has the velcro on the back and it's just one strap so it's very comfortable as you're wearing it you know you don't have to worry about having that big old mask on with uh you know, big old rubber mask and all kind of thing that gets all in the way and fogged up. But this one right here, it, it works good. Good. It's um, uh, it says a filter technology introducing the M2 mesh mask, freedom of motion through simplicity and innovation, adjustable hook and loop enclosure, durable mesh material. One way discharge valve removes condensation and then it has the you could replace the carbon filter and it has an adjustable nose clip. So this nose clip right here helps keep keeps it tight from that area. But what's important is that you know whenever you need a new filter, you just take this one off right here, you know, unscrew these caps and go ahead and toss this one and just put a brand new one on there and you're good, you're good to go. So Pretty much you just gotta buy this uh, outside part, you know, once, and then you just buy the filters anytime you need more. But this is a great investment because you gotta make sure you protect them lungs, people, please. 
So, okay, I guess I took up enough of your time. Hopefully you enjoyed these um, gift ideas and hopefully I was able to help you guys. If you like the video, go ahead and give it a like. If you haven't subscribed yet to the channel, please subscribe. Once again, thank you for helping me reach uh, 100 subscribers. Now I'm on my way to um, 200. Hopefully I can reach that one as well. And in the meantime, you keep on doing what you do. And um, I'll see you on the next one, people.